So tonight's another great game with my fancy Eldar. And tonight I'm gonna be facing Mr. John over here. With his neck runs. And because I was letting my opponent go first and tell the sexy audience about his or her or X army. Because we have to be gender gender nice. Um, John, wanna tell the audience what you have first? Yep, no problem. I got a battalion with Orc and the Diviner. An overlord with the staff of light and a res orb, a squad of 17 warriors, 10 warriors, and then 10 immortals with Tesla. And then I have uh, two doom sites for my flyers in the detachment. Then I have an outrider detachment with a command barge with a uh, staff of light and a Tesla cannons, six tomb blades with Tesla, six wraiths with nothing, and then nine scarabs. You know, one, one of the big things I love about Necrons is they're so simple. Always easy. Just so straight and simple. That's what I like. And for me, starting off with my battalion, my warlord is a little prox because I want to start trying them out. This is a striking scorpion, um, Cardarius, I think it is, something like that, I don't know. Um, he's, he or she, it, let's go with that, it, has sand war gear, it's my warlord, so the six up feeling pain. Striking scorpions with, uh, extract with, uh, scorpion's claw. Banshees, um, two, well, three squads, well, two squads of ten Pathfinders, one squad of six Pathfinders, six, um, Dark Reapers, five Fire, ah, my goodness, I'm sorry, five Orb Spiders, one Viper with a Bright Lance, um, Wave Surfing with the Twin Elder Missile Launcher, Fire Prism, Night Spinner, ten Dire Avengers, two Far Seers, and they both know Mind War and Doom, Fire Dragons, and Wraith Guard with the um, D Sykes, and nice little proxy for the Crimson Hunter Exarch. So, and now for the tabletop, it's going to be Dawn of War, basically going this way. Six objectives, and that's really it. We'll see what happens after the deployment. This is what the deployment zone deployment looks like. And before I forget, um, my guys are on the L Talk craft world. So basically, if they're more than 12 inches away from me, it's minus one to hit. So, pretty nice. And just try to steal that initiative. Give me the Iron Cross. Got it. Awesome. Let's see what happens. So, movement was basically moved that, advanced the Banshees, and my second phase, well, I forgot that you can't do two, two of the same psychic powers, so only doing the Fire Prism. So, yeah, shooting phase. So, my shooting phase, starting from over here going, Mr. Um, Crimson Hunter actually caused a bunch of wounds on the Fire Cause, I think. Two damage on him? Four damage, yes. Then the Dark Creepers actually came and did more damage. I think six total, something like that. Yep. Sounds good to me. Um, then with the all the snipers, now I got all those warriors, just one guy, thank God. Um, Night Spinner didn't really do anything. Fire Prism did kill. Yep. You know what? It was just a bunch of worlds that died because of that. And that, and that. That's basically my turn. Um, John, you have to do a morale check, right? Yeah, I'm going to spend two slay auto pass. God damn it. And then he can't fail because uh, mm, Okay, well, you're moving phase then. Tell everybody what you did. I'm still figuring out where my barrage is going. Hmm. Well, you did that. I'm just going to say that. I know this guy flew, they ran. This is just freaking amazing right here. I love that. Crawling up the building. Spooky. And everything else just basically moved. It yeah. looks like. Those guys flew up there. Everyone else kind of moved forward. Okay, well. Psychic face. Guess what? Necrons don't have a psychic face. So now you're shooting phase. Oh, but probably mine. You want to skip your shooting phase and assault phase and making my turn. I think that's a no. Damn. So, it was really painful for me this turn. Um, first off, John called six wounds on my Crimson Hunter with his little Tesla... That's right. 
Death Ray, French croissant thing, my Bob. Um, so these guys caused like 26 wounds on these four six rangers and they got fried to death. Um, the fire dragons got shot by a ton of stuff, but at the end of the day, only four got killed, sadly. Um, Heat Ray, Heat Ray, right? Uh, his Heat Ray. Yeah, Heat Ray into this actually caused uh, six wounds, but the Spirit Stones actually knocked off two wounds, thank God. Um, that was really it. That, um, all the highlights. Have I missed anything at all? So you lost a couple years, Matt Squad, and Matt Squad, too. Oh yeah, I got um, some Orioles shot into them. They got a couple of guys killed. Um, the not the death, not the heat. The Tesla killed four uh, Dire Avengers. So now it is time for my morale. Um, was up seven. So trying to think if I'm a little upset. Actually, let me turn this thing off. So deep strike these guys in. I uh, tried doing a uh, minor on the flyer, didn't work out, but I did smite him and I did cause one wound. Um, Wraith Killer popped out of the vehicle and ran that way. And I did not get Doom off right there on the fire prism. So, yeah, shooting face. So, starting over here real quick, the Banshee's uh, killed. Yeah, yeah, one Tomb Blade with the pistols, thank God. This SOB I hate with a passion between crack missiles, the fire dragons, the viper, and the, the um, D Sykes. Only has two health left. I'm so angry right now. Yeah. Um, the Rangers knocked off some moves on that spooky guy right there. Yep. And over here, I don't remember what I did. Um, Oh yeah, this guy actually shot down the flyer with bright lances, thank god. Um, then the night spinner, well, between the night spinner, the dire vengers, I killed a ton of the, um, scarabs, my goodness, I'm bad at names. Over here, only one of those guys got killed by the, by the rangers. That was really it. Um, now my super fun assault phase. So the Banshees did their thing, and they caused one damage, while four of them got killed because of the my will be my will will be done, and see what happens with me and the girls. And fine, awesome. Well, your movement turn. So the Necrons keep on moving. What do they move? John. Oh, Orkin just shuffle back to hold this objective. Immortals are slowly creeping forward. This guy's inching up. These guys are piling in the middle and getting ready to shoot this. Those buddies are lining up to shoot that. The Wraith's closed in on these rangers over here. Scarabs want to say hi to the Guardians. The Flyer just pieced out from those D sites. And then the Tomb Blades fell back and moved over there. Ooh, well, this is going to be fun. It's looking pretty uh, hard for me. John, please tell us what you did. Uh, the Immortals just lit up. Banshees and took them out thanks to my will be done. Uh, Tomb Blades tried to shoot the deep sites, only got one of them down. Space Donut failed to hit everything. All these warriors and the Overlord and uh, Command Barge all teamed up to take down the flyer. And everyone else is just kind of waiting to charge because they can't shoot. Okay, well, uh, sword phase then. This is horrible because, for us off the little creepy bugs. Uh, Overwatch with the Dire Vengers, I did take off one model stand, but they charged me and, well, the, yeah, they sunk beyond belief. Uh, another problem is the Rangers, six of them got killed, but they didn't do daily spots, so. They also didn't run away, though. Yeah, they actually got a one for the morale, so which is pretty good, I guess. Toughing it out. Yeah, now it is my turn. So the movement was very simple. Um, they moved, they stayed, they stayed, they moved, and my scorpions popped out of there. <laughs> so super quickly, Wraith Guard destroyed the uh, what are these? Tomb Blades. There we go. Um, only one damage was caused on this by the Viper over here. The Dark Creepers, the Fire Prism caused some damage on the uh, Immortals. 
while the forest seal shot at that and did some damage. Rope spiders shot at the uh, Warriors kill too. Is that really it for the shooting phase? Oh yeah. One to Orican. Yeah, and the scorpions caused one wound on Orican. Now it'll okay. get better. Well, let's we'll see what happens. I think so they're all gonna hold on to stuff. Yeah. Yeah, it works, I guess. That's <laughs> kind of how they move anyway. So in the assault phase, my first skill kills the scarabs, killing all of them. My God, I'm surprised. Well, the range died. Um, eight, the four of them, and I failed eight. Well, those four left, and I failed eight saves. So yeah, that's it. So, Johnstone. Um, what did you move? The Immortals are piling forward to get rid of these deep sites once and for all. Warriors are just blobbing up in the middle. These guys are hanging out. Wraiths are creeping on in the back line and the Space Donuts just kind of not trying not to die. No. Psychic phase. Nothing. Shooting phase. Did he shoot? That's a good question. Uh, this guy shot into these guys and killed like three of them. Uh, mortal shot and did some damage to the D-Scythe guys. Yep, just killed and did one wound. These warriors shot another guy in the building and killed two. These guys lit up the warp spiders and killed a whole bunch of them. And the space donut killed like one dude and killed everything else. Let's kill one of the dark creepers. Yep. Well, any assault? Yep. What do you want to assault? He's going to end up going into uh, these guys. Okay, well, let's see what happens. Assault phase was beautiful because number one, he assaulted my warp spider, got two sixes for overwatch, but I got two ones for the wounds and they pounded me into dust. Over here, my poor poor striking scorpions got hammered. Three died, one died to morale. Three died, then one just died from morale, but she I did four back. And I caused four wounds on him, so not that bad. So no, my turn. It was basically just those guys, that's it. Psychic phase, I actually mind ward, oh, smited with this far seer to the croissant and actually killed it. I like that, a lot. I love these guys because they just killed all the immortals. Thank God. And one of the wraiths got killed by the dark creepers. Now it's time for the fun assault phase. I was doing so good. Only one wound left. It's a living metal sport. Yeah. Well, let's see what happens. I just want to say that Flying Birds is a wussy because they want to get Scorpion Claw to death. Nope. She got other plans. So, what else moves? Orican finally became a Katan god thingy. He's going over here to just punch this dude out of existence. These guys kind of fell back to shoot some stuff up. My will be done. Totally forgot to move that guy. These guys move forward, and the rates all just crept through the building. Okay. Psychic phase. Nothing. Shooting phase. So um, I am going. I am losing my my mind thinking I saw a cardboard penis. Somebody was killing around. Um, John, what did he do? Uh, killed the last uh, Exarch lady thing over here. Command barge. They shot into those and killed one. They shot into there, but they made all their saves. Oh, yes. Assault phase, yes. Yep. So, it was a field charge right there against Katanas. And over here, um, one wound was causing the knife spinner, and the knife spinner did got one hit, one wound, but the save was made. Oh. That was very spooky, so I flew away. Moved, advanced, that's really it, and yeah, smite, I smashed a bug with smite, mine war, well, I got a one on it, so, did nothing. Yeah, the wraith, shot two wraith cannon, I'm at D sites, caused two wounds on him, one wound, my bad. Um, over here, I didn't really do anything, yeah. I did kill a lot of the warriors between the Fire Prism, Bright Lance, Missile Launcher. They'll be back. No, they won't. My sword was insane, and I actually fisted the Bargs to death. I like that. She likes fisting too. Huh, okay.
Also moving there, looks like. Everyone's staying right out of my deployment for the defense. And these boy boys moved up. Delightful. Oh, total of, oh my god, my phone. 30 Fox into Cantress. Ellen only served for two wounds. I like that a lot. That's it. Basil's over here. And basically, I caused one wound. Two of mine got killed. I'm moving there. And Smite killed one of these SOBs. I finally killed that one squad that I started off with. I am so happy. It, so it did. Over here, my Wraith Guard actually knocked him out to two wounds. I like this. Now, for the last assault phase of mine. I actually killed the Overlord, and she only has two wounds left. Yeah, the Wraith Guard got smashed and did steadily squat. I like you. Yeah. Shit. Longstorm was basically killing the, the pole wraith lords that did nothing to him. But Katanas actually killed set, a total of eight warriors. This is insane. I like this. Time we blended everything together. Um, yeah, he, well, Katanas actually wiped out the remaining. Um, Warriors, but because I have to consolidate Krogs, the closest enemy unit, I went away from the objective. Those rates are scary. Yeah, heck yeah they are. But this is what the table looks like. Um, yeah, I only have one uh, Dark Reaper left, actually. It was just way too hard to get my hand in there and not knock out the models. But I had a total of, let's see here, 10 from the cards. Then 11, because I killed the Warlord. That's it. So I had 11, then you had... I had uh, 13 plus first blood and line breaker, so 15. Hey, John, honestly, man, that was a good game like always. Good game. Um, any final thoughts at all? No. Is it fun? Is Orkin it... is a boss. He is. I am... cannon dudes are scary, but Orkin didn't care. <laughs> oh, we can say that again. Well, until next, next time, guys. Actually, till tomorrow, guys. Stay awesome.